Did you buy a used Mercedes ECU and dealer told you they cannot program it to your car because it's already programmed to another car? I will show you how we virginize, renew this ECU that the dealer or anyone with a dealer level computer can program it to your car. This is Dan, and in this video, we're gonna virginize this ECU so you can get it programmed to your vehicle. The tools we're gonna be using for this job, a Britas, we need our ME 9.7 adapter because this is ME 9.7 ECU. Now, if you do have the tools, we're gonna go hit a Britas, programmer, Mercedes. We're gonna go offline, and as soon as our Britas boots up, we're gonna connect we are going to choose OBD, Special Functions, DOS Manager, and Engine Control Unit. And we're going to read this donor ECU. This should have key data and VIN number from a previous car. And if you can see, this unit is personalized and activated. So it's programmed with all the key information from the other vehicle or to the other vehicle. And of course, the unit is activated, which means it is locked. The dealer cannot rewrite this. Also, we can see the VIN number here. This is the VIN number of a previous junkyard vehicle. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna hit virginize and this thing over the internet through a Britis servers, it will virginize this. You can only virginize this on the bench. So if it's in the car, it will not work. That's why these adapters that I have, you must have them for every car. Now, if you can see unit not personalized and also unit not activated. So this thing is good to go. This customer now can actually program this computer to his car. This is like new Virgin Mercedes ECU. Watch my other video, how we clone these ECUs. That way you don't have to pay the dealer or a shop to have it personalized to your vehicle. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next video.